So here are the four congruence postulates. Side, 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 angle, side, angle, side, angle, and now angle, angle, side, which you found is a result of angle, side, angle. Take a look at this triangle here, with angles of 60 degrees and 75 degrees, and the side opposite the 75 degree angle has length 6. So you know angle, angle, side for this triangle. Which of these triangles down here are congruent to the triangle up here? And here's a hint, there's more than one. Nicely done! Going around this triangle, we have a side of length 6, a 60 degree angle, and a 75 degree angle. So does this triangle, 6, 60 degrees, 75 degrees, so it must be congruent. And this triangle is also congruent, and we can see that by flipping it around. These other two triangles also have a side of length 6, and angles of 60 and 75 degrees, but they're arranged in different ways. For this triangle, the angles surround the side, so you can see it's not congruent. And for this triangle, it's the 60 degree angle, rather than the 75 degree angle, that's opposite from the side of length 6. So when you're comparing triangles, pay close attention to those matching sides and angles.